hey guys welcome back to our channel where i inspire your desire to be great to be great to be great thank you guys so much for tuning in watching another video you guys today is sunday september 18th 2022 happy sunday you guys thank you guys so much to my amazing supporters for always being so supportive of me i appreciate every single one of you guys so we're gonna get straight into this video this video was like a highly requested video so i'm doing it for y'all um so as y'all could tell by the title this is 10 plus ways how to make money while you are in school so while you're in school most of the time like you don't really need to make a lot of money and i'm not saying that in a bad way but i'm saying that in the sense that you don't have like a high level of responsibility so you know the in, the way you make money while you're in school doesn't have to be the same as when you're not um of when you're out of school and when you have a higher level of responsibility so this can apply to like my high schoolers but this is mainly like mainly to my college students or my seniors in high school transitioning into college um so i'm going to share with you guys 10 plus ways of how to make money while you're in school these are proven ways proven methods to make money i'm gonna have some link in the description box to help you guys out um so we're gonna get straight into it one of the first ways yet obvious ways to make money is while you're in school is you can get a job i don't recommend a full-time job because i've seen like i feel like it's harder um when you're in school to work a full-time job compared to working like a part-time job so a part-time job is usually considered anywhere 20 hours a week or less which i feel like that's manageable for someone that's a college student um in comparison to like trying to go to school and work full-time it's really not easy unless you're going to be in school part-time then yes a full-time job is definitely manageable but like i said um part-time is definitely suggested um another way that you can make money while you're in school this specifically applies to college it doesn't apply to high school it's called work study so work study is usually financial aid offers you a certain amount of money where you can take a job on campus so um usually like your school will have a list of where you can find work study jobs available on campus you can apply and usually work study jobs are easy to get because that means the department isn't paying for um paying you to do the job directly out of their budget financial aid is the one that budgeted to compensate you for doing that job so work study is another great way um to make money on campus i mean while in school usually everybody don't qualify for work study usually it's people that um, make a certain amount of money that qualify for work study another way that you can make money is by selling so selling, um, I usually recommend selling products that you enjoy, products that you use, or even your study materials. So for example, if you're a person that enjoys like snacks, for example, I have friends that when I was in high school, they used to sell snacks, they used to sell candy, um, they used to sell juice and things like that. So most teenagers, they enjoy snacks. We enjoy junk food or whatever so i feel like that's a good product to sell as a high schooler at least um as far as college is concerned i recommend you could sell products that you use um some college students like they live on campus they might not have the time or the resources to go to like bj's or go to um certain like stores or whatever themselves so you know you could sell them certain products that you use whether it's shampoo conditioner like everyday products that you will need that someone else might um be able to utilize so that's another thing that you could sell and then study materials so in college studying is a big thing if you know and everybody don't usually know how to study studying isn't the easiest thing to figure out how to do so um I know when I was in college um after like each semester or whatever like me and some of my friends we would talk and if I took a certain class like I remember one of my friends I took a Spanish class and he was taking Spanish the following semester so 
um, I gave him my materials of what I used in that class but sometimes you don't have to give it to the person if you don't know them you could just sell it to them whether it's for 10 bucks whether it's for 20 bucks um, so that's another suggestion or you could resell your textbooks um, that's another big thing but textbooks flashcards study guides summaries stuff like that like you can market those um, the other thing that you could do to make money in college and this one is a big one especially for the business minded people people that don't mind like working for themselves um, because working for yourselves like it comes with a lot of motivation and a lot of discipline when you have a job it's like okay I have to get up at this time to be at this place compared to as an entrepreneur like you could have an appointment that same day and you got to drop what you're doing to um, you know fulfill that appointment so some of the services that you could offer while you're in school which is great services to make money one of them is hairdressing if you know how to do hair y'all don't be scared to offer the services to college student because remember college students respectfully they're broke <laughs> right like they haven't started their career they haven't made money yet or anything like that and even in high school the same thing so you could do your friend's hair you could do people's hair and charge them money and it doesn't have to you don't have to charge them the same amount that a professional charged them but you could charge them enough to make you money so for example knotless braids are typically like two hundred dollars if you know how to braid and install knotless braids even if you only get one appointment a week like if you only book one client a week um, and you charge two hundred dollars that's two hundred dollars a week that you're making just for spending money you know what i'm saying so you could do like um you could offer services to make money as a college student another service that's a good one um one of my friends he does this um, you could cut people's hair on campus and you could be the campus barber if I may say and that's another way that you can make money um, makeup if you are really like into makeup if you're great at doing makeup that's another service that you could offer you could do people's makeup and you could charge them for it especially on college campuses like some girls they don't know how to do makeup or maybe when they're going out you know they want to feel good they want to feel pampered they want to feel spoiled so they want somebody to do their makeup that's another thing that you could do um, landscaping um, if you know like most college campuses they have like um like housing right outside of the dorms and all that stuff there's college apartments and things like that and of course on those properties um, landscaping needs to be done or even senior citizens like as you get older and things like that you know you don't want to be outside really cutting your grass so I know some people that are senior citizens and they hire you know teenagers and things like that to cut their grass to rake their leaves and stuff like that so landscaping is another service that you could do um another big 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 one I remember this was big when we was in college and in high school a little bit too but preferably college this is a big like service that you could offer to make money and that service is driving okay driving is like really big because on campus it's like it's either you have a car or you don't or it's either you could take the bus or you can't and for example when I was in college I know a lot of like college students would go out to the bars they would drink they would get drunk they would have a good time and of course they need to get home and they need a reliable driver so I know a few people like people used to pay them they would make $50 like in one night just from having to bring like two or three people that make sure that they get home safe so you can make a good side hustle off of doing that of just driving people back and forth either to their destination where they want to go because when you drive of course it saves time taking the bus isn't a bad thing because it saves money but it does cost you your time so if you want to be more time effective it's not a bad idea if you have a friend that's on um, campus and they have a car you could pay them to drive you to wherever you need to go so that's another way that you can make money the other way that um, I want to talk about that's another good way to make money I wish I thought of this way when I was in college but I didn't until like now but that's okay um, you can create content and as a content creator you could create content on YouTube you could create content on Instagram you could create content even on Facebook and get paid to create these contents and 
um like college is a huge industry right it's a way that people got to know how to navigate so you could create content as a college student like strictly as a college student on how to navigate through college and make money like that because remember there are people from all over the world that are first generation college students i'm a first generation college student and college was completely new to me like learning fafsa learning financial aid learning how to get scholarships learning how to make money learning how to um buy my books like all of those things like people want to learn how to do that you know what i'm saying um knowing how to um live on campus like what's it like living on campus is it scary um like you know what i'm saying like college is just a whole world of itself and you could create content strictly on that in college and that's another way that you can make money um another way that you can make money while you're in college is um be a rideshare driver so of course uber is big lyft is big um and again if you have a car on campus you could do this at any time at your convenience you could do it when you want wherever you want so uber and lyft is another way that you can make money um being a delivery driver which is a little bit separate from uber and lyft because as a rideshare driver you're bringing people as a delivery driver you're bringing products or food so there's instacart there's doordash there's uber eats like those are delivery services and you could definitely do them and make money and the beautiful thing with those things is you could do them whenever you want if you have morning classes you could do them in the evening if you have night classes you could do them in the morning so you could pretty much do them whenever you want which is a great thing um and then the last way that i'm going to tell you guys that you can also make money in school i also know people that did this and you can make good money doing it is by being a sitter so being a sitter you could be a babysitter you could babysit people's kids on campus there are people that have children and they need someone to watch them so you could watch them either on campus or even if you're in high school you could also be a babysitter in high school that's another great way to make money you could also be a pet sitter people love their pets you guys know that they love their pets sometimes they have to go somewhere and they need someone reliable to leave their pets with you could pet sit um and the last way of being a sitter is house sitting so i also know someone that used to do house sitting people like you know especially wealthy people they travel a lot and you know they don't just want to leave their homes like unattended or unprotected so they hire someone to house it you know and usually at the house there's little things to do you know there's maybe to maybe they have pets sometimes you probably got to feed the pet or they want you to check the mail or they want you to you know maybe clean up or maybe they're expecting something so you know you just got to babysit their house and make sure that everything is good so that is the last and final way i really hope that you guys enjoyed this video comment below things y'all did when y'all was in high school or college to make money if i missed anything or if there's anything i could add feel free to drop a comment below so that's all i have for you guys thank you guys so much for tuning in i hope you guys enjoyed this video i will see you guys in the next video where i inspire your desire to be great to be great to be great bye